Oh, hey, what's up? Here's your week three overview. It's week three. Do you know who this person is? Soon you will. So this week we pivot to the long run before getting back into the short run. What's the difference? So this is John Maynard Keynes, the father of macroeconomics. Now economics has been around for at least since 1776 with Adam Smith, but macroeconomics, the study of recessions and how to stabilize the economy has only been around since the 1930s. And it came into being because of this man, John Maynard Keynes. He is famous for, among other things, drawing our attention to the fact and proving the fact that capitalist free market economies are not inherently stable and they cannot get themselves out of a recession. So to those classical old school economists that were always saying things like, oh, don't worry, it'll get better. The market will always solve its own problems. He offers this. And here's my best upper class British accent. In the long run, we are all dead. Economists set themselves too easy, too useless a task, if in tempestuous seasons they can only tell us that when the storm is past, the ocean is flat again. So while looking at the long run is a really good thing, and here you're looking at gross domestic product, we'll talk more about that in a future chapter, um, and we're looking at actual production or actual GDP versus potential or our maximum capacity. And you see that over time, the US has grown on average. So long run trend, we're looking good. And that's a whole set of economic study. But notice that there's fluctuations around this trend line. We don't always have 3% growth. And that's the study of macroeconomics. Why don't we always have constant growth? So here you're looking at short run fluctuations. So we're looking at um, unemployment and GDP in a, a little bit closer lens here, and we're seeing the ups and downs. And every time you see a vertical gray bar, that's a recession. So you can bet that unemployment rises during a recession, GDP usually falls during recession. So this week is pretty normal. Um, hopefully you're getting into the swing of things. We've got our reading. This is a long run growth chapter seven. It's called 20 sometimes in the split textbook, but the links are all to the same chapter. Um, we have the play posit videos and we have that inequality for all uh, film and worksheet that I uh, shared with you last week. It's now up and due this Friday. And next week, exciting news, we have our first exam. You will get a study guide. The exam happens Wednesday through Friday at your convenience. Once you open it, you are timed and you will finish taking it. There will be a Thursday morning um, optional, instead of an optional lecture, it'll be an optional Q&A about, um, about the study guide and any questions you might have. And if you're interested in forming a study group, come to office hours Monday. From my family to yours, have a great week.